quizzes. Well, we'll eventually. This yeah, we'll, is Douglas we'll, versus. We'll see it on the stream setup. Douglas versus some Marth guy. It's gonna be Marth did us. He's got a match That's hey, true. That is, that is very true. <laughs> I think that was PDR <laughs> signing off. You're next. Not next. He no. is next. No, I'm not actually next. PDR. Sniffing intensifies. Yes. So, you know, if anything different, I I like this whole setup. Can you hear me from this right now? Cool. Yep. This is awesome. Great. It, yeah, it's really good sound quality. Okay. So we have Cameron on the mic right now, aka The Spy Machine. The Spy Machine. You can follow me on Twitter at the underscore spy underscore machine. If, I mean, you feel like it. Yeah. You know, find, find yourself on Twitter. Yeah. Twiddling around on Twitter. All right, so we have AU versus so we have a Douglas. Match. Do you know who AU is? I have never I actually don't know who AU is. I think, I think uh, Kyle said he was a, a San Diego uh, mark. Okay. He's talking about some San Diego Martha around here, but I don't. But then Jeremy said that he knew everybody on the on the roster, so yeah. I don't the know. Kyle is just like whatever. All right. So nice. All right. So we know who Douglas is. Douglas is MK. Sets up an excellent setup. Yes. Gets him up in the air and just like lowers him down with attacks that will eventually like lead to force match. Force match covers a really wide range of places that his opponent could be. Like hit him in spots that like kind of like around that area, you just throw it out. Yeah. And it hits them sometimes. And if it doesn't, sometimes they punish it, sometimes they don't. Depends on the player. Nice. Get the grab. Get them on the stage. Okay. Get them above him. Like we said before, like getting your opponent above you is huge. You want to yeah. stop throw? And now do like follow ups. I think what he's sort of, he's not uh, really doing well at the moment. He's, he's throwing out the first aerial or move on the ground. Forces the second jump, but he's not really following up after. And it's that. funny, we just talked about that on the right here. Oh, really? Like how he likes to bait that out, but I guess not. I guess not, do this. Nice, dashes around. Hope that he's not going to be in his shield and just throws out a forward smash. I'd like to see, see more safer options than just forward smash. Forward smash on the ground, if if, if shielded against, can get punished really hard. Yeah. Especially against oh, the goes, character. Goes down there. Did he really oh, do that? Yeah. Did he really do that? He's just a little baby back Do it. Got him. <laughs> Trying to rep MK, MK hard. <laughs> Doing MK proud. Okay. All right, get the grab. Let's see what he's going to do with this. Throw, down throws him. Okay. Wow. Douglas going to score his patent. I'm going to double jump really fast. We like to <laughs> call that the jelly back in the day. The jelly? That's the funny. jelly, yep. Or was it the Jordan? I don't know. A, a notable player of, of ours back in the day who liked to double jump a lot. That was a mark grab. Yeah, we want to. We definitely want to jump a lot less often when we're off the stage. Yeah. Unless we're recovering right on the ledge to uh to lessen our exposure. Yeah, to well, the outside to, to to edge guards. And especially when you have Marth right there who has yeah. force match right With with the big sword. Yeah. If you look if you look at his belt, he has a sheath. Yeah. That's used to to hold such a huge sword. You can tell just by yeah. standing there that he's got a long. Yeah, long range. This is our this okay. is our keep away. This is the keep away character for a reason. All right, looking to get an edge guard. A little bit late on that one. They're both sort of doing the same thing. They're getting each other off the edge and then waiting yeah. for the second jump. Or yeah, not they're not really forcing each other's like space really well. Yeah. Ooh, force yeah. smash. Yeah. Like I said, he got he got punished. Look what just happened out that yeah. uh, force smash on shield. Now he's dead. Exactly. He's out of here. Four tilt and then hit. Uh, yeah. One exploded. These characters utilizing what I was talking about earlier, dash dancing, dash dancing, keeps your opponent on edge as to where you're actually going to be. Yeah. Really so good. He's got him off. Oh, I don't Ooh. think he knew he had a jump. Ooh. Oh nice air God. dodge. Yeah, forward smash is just. It's good sometimes, but if your opponent knows you want to do it, you're going to get punished out of it. Yeah. Okay. Sometimes you can just lose an entire stock from it. Okay, there we go. Oh, God. That was him. Hit him out. Yeah? There we go. And he could grab him out of that, but decides just to down tilt him. Switch, switch his spots with him. <laughs> Teleports. Okay. AU looks a little scared right now. It seems like he's. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He was yeah. questioning a lot of the stuff he was doing at the edge there. Yep. So he wasn't, like, acting right out of anything. Andy with his patent. 
cigarette behind the ear. Pretty much a poker player. What are you thinking? They went FD. So they went FD, so I'm thinking just going to go Yoshi story. That's what I was thinking too. But no, I get proven wrong. Oh yeah, no, yeah, I don't know. I mean, this kind of makes sense. I mean, I don't know. He should just want to like a, a smaller stage just so like anything can happen. Like it's, he's getting outplayed a little bit by uh, Ziggler, so he wants yeah. smaller stages probably to try to heighten the uh, volatility of the matchup. Yeah, that's true. Oh wow. Dude, wow, that was a really good stock by him. He he punished a, a bad, badly spaced down tilt from AU, and then he got a power shield off his forward air, yeah. and then killed him off. Dublis, he has no problem throwing out forward smashes in neutral. And AU's just not punishing it. He's just not seeing his shield enough. Yeah, that's true. You can dash chance a lot, but like if you get caught, if you're in your opponent's forward smash range and you're not shielding, you're just going to get hit. You are going to get hit, and they're going to like it's going to be like a good, it's going to be a quote unquote like good maneuver to use. Yeah. Until you punish them enough out of it. So shields are a really big thing to use. So yeah, I want to see more. I want to see more shields from the AU. Ooh, that was ooh, catch them. Great. Oh, okay. But then he got a little slow. On yeah. That. Decided to dash. Decided to do some fancy stuff on platforms. He's got. He got a jump. He has a jump. Yeah. Oh. Okay. When he threw that force smash, he was nowhere close to him. He was never going to hit by that force smash. AU. Interesting down smash? Mars just wants to get in, get those pokes, get like very safe pokes, and then dip, get a dip out if you can get the right punch. And again, stop getting above your opponent, because you're going to get hit with certain moves. And you're not going to be able to counterattack if they happen to miss. Whereas if you're on the ground, there are counterattacks available. Well, there are counterattacks if you're above your opponent, but like, they require a bit more technical prowess from. Yeah, you know, yeah. yeah, that's definitely true. Right. Okay. Dublis is like running around. See, he missed, and he goes and dashing. Still, yeah. Because because AU hasn't really been shielding them. He's either been trying yeah, to get out not, of the way or rolling. He is not shielding one out of a, out of an approach. So if you know your opponent's never going to shield, just throw a move out. Yeah. 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 <laughs> good job. Good job, Jared. Good job, listening. I just coached him. That was good. That was smooth. Nice, yeah, smooth like butter. See, Jared. Jared's doing another thing that's really good too. Like if you think your opponent's going to be taking all the safe routes, you just take ledge from them. Yeah. And make them their safe their safe maneuvers or their safe recoveries not so safe. So then they have to take risky maneuvers afterwards. Yeah. Well, then they from there on out have to start taking risky maneuvers to get on stage. Yeah, I expect to close closes out pretty fast. Okay, that was he good. Is not Running around enough, he's not getting enough enough. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh, dear! Oh my Neil gosh, dear! How did, how did he even get the spike out of that? Yes. Good job, Jack. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Where's Docmo? Oh, he's playing a match. 